physics, biology, chemistry, yeah, physics, biology, chemistry, yeah, let's do some science now, yeah, 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 kitchen pantry science, yeah, 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 let's do some science now, yeah, 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 kitchen pantry science, yeah. Hi, I'm Liz, the Kitchen Pantry Scientist, and I'm here to show you some simple recipes for real science, using things you already have around your house. Today's project is called tie-dye milk, and it's one of my kids' favorites. All you'll need is milk, a shallow plate or bowl, food coloring like you buy at the grocery store, a small dish of water, Q-tips, and dish soap. Now, this experiment will teach us a little bit about surface tension and what it looks like when you break it. When you pour the milk into your plate or bowl, the surface of the milk forms sort of a skin, like the rubber part of an inflated balloon. And the detergent we're going to use is sort of like little spears or knives that's going to pop the balloon or break the surface of the milk. And when you pop the balloon, what happens? Does all the air come rushing out of the hole? Yeah. Yeah. So that's kind of what happens when you pop the surface tension of the milk. All the milk comes rushing out from underneath and swirls around the food coloring that we're going to put on, making cool patterns. It's kind of like, looks like magic. So let's try it. We poured our milk in the bowl. Now what we need to do is put some drops of food coloring on the milk. So just take some food coloring, put a couple drops of each color. And these are the colors that are going to swirl around when we break the surface tension of the milk. Yeah. Whoa, that one bubbled. All right, that looks great, you guys. Now, oh, what we're going to do that's good, that's good. is add a little detergent. Add a little detergent to the water. It's fine. Oh, it looks great. And then, you guys, can you help me mix it up? Thank you. All right, now what you're going to do is take your Q-tips and touch them to the surface of the milk. Don't stir, just touch it. Whoop, cool. And like I said, the detergent breaks the surface tension of the milk. And the food coloring swirls around as the milk rushes out from underneath the surface. So this experiment is fun, it's easy, and you should try it. If you want to read the directions or read more about it, go to my website at kitchenpantryscientist.com. Have fun.